Good morning, everyone. It is June the 25th, 2022. Looks like Robert's fixing to go up the ladder. I know we're against the sun's wanting to come through the windows, but he's got about two more rows up there. Let me see if I can get over and show you the sun. Sorry. See them two holes up in there? That do not that does not have insulation. That's the last ones. Now he's got to straighten up the guardrail because he does have guardrail on the scaffolding that is three sections high. But in order to get it under the beams, he has to take the guardrail down, then put it and move the scaffolding then put the guardrail back up he can only stand up in this outer section here when he's up there the rest of the time he's on his hands and knees he's done this entire ceiling both sides it looks wonderful y'all he has an R, what is it, R2032? I think it's an R, it's a 23 and a 15, that's an R38. Add my numbers. Now we have been getting stuff up the ladder. I'll show you, well, how we do it. He's got a chain that he puts across because he can't get the other rail up there. So he uses a chain. And when he's working with the insulation, he has a mask. N95, we all know about the masks now. So he's got that chain up there that helps hold him to make sure he doesn't have any kind of, let's say, mishap. Heaven forbid that ever happened. So... Now he has rigged a box. Get down here. He has made a box that we put on the ladder. That puts stuff that we put stuff in. Then I have to. There's a hump in a ladder. You know how a ladder stretches out. I have to raise it over that hump, and he pulls everything up. So I have been his helper by loading his box for him to get the stuff up there. So in my own way, I've been I've been needed, y'all. <laughs> uh oh. Well, well then let's get that roll. And that has happened. Things would get dropped. Get have to get picked up. I gotta put it back, put it in the box. There goes the box again. And that there it comes again. So he'll get that shiny paper up on the ceiling in there and then uh, start passing up the insulation the insulation comes in great big bags I'm sure a lot of us have seen insulation before they have to be cut open this is not the pink stuff we didn't want that pink stuff. That pink stuff will burn. So we got the um, st the rock wool. Made out of rock and slag. Y'all do your research on it if you want to know more about it. But it's coming along. Walls are done. Got to go back down there and do the front wall above the windows T 
the day before he finishes, he'll um, do the finish up the back ball. But this is what's been going on here lately. So, look, we'll talk to y'all later. Maybe video again. Right now we've got to get the uh, sides insulated. This is just the center. There's a left and a right side, like an old barn. So, let me tell you. Insulation ain't cheap. We done spent, I don't know how many thousands of dollars we done spent on insulation. That's just for the ceiling. We didn't insulate the walls. Well, we did the wall in here. But, uh, right there. That's an eight-foot wall right there that you're looking at. Overhead. And then you go into the arch section, the high-rise section. So, this could be a two-story house, but we didn't want it as a two-story house. We just wanted a cathedral ceiling. However, if the house is ever sold and somebody wants a two-story in the center section, there's plenty of foundation already put in that all they got to do, have somebody to come in and build it and put it in. And they've got windows on each end that will open. The center, two center sections will open. So somebody can make a two-story house out of this if they so choose. So, look, we'll uh, talk to y'all later. Robert's at work, and he'll need me in a little bit. So y'all have a great day. Bye-bye.